What's up, you guys? Welcome to my channel, Spiritual Advisor here, and I'm back with the truth. Thank y'all for being here. I don't have any messages, so I'm just gonna pour energy and see what's going on with y'all. What's going on in y'all life? Okay, I'm gonna get in y'all business for a minute. Okay, y'all. Let's see. I did some readings, but I didn't. I haven't uploaded them yet, y'all. So I guess after I do this reading. I just uploaded all three of them. I did a part one and a part two. And then this reading. So, let's see what y'all got going on. So, if they caught over there by itself, I'm going to take it. So, we have do not be tempted to lower your standards. Can y'all see that? So, this could be any situation, whatever you're going through. It could be um, dealing with, um, you know, in a relationship. You could be married or don't have to be. You know what I'm saying? This could be um, a work situation, um, a family situation, whatever this means to you. Do not be tempted to lower your standards, okay? If it's a job and you really don't want this job and you know you're better than that, you know what I'm saying? You know you you can get, you can, um... What is it you can, um, you find better or it's not paying you enough and you know you good or, you know what I'm saying? Some of y'all work better alone. Some of y'all meant to be like entrepreneurs working for yourself, not working with anybody else or like me, like I don't like rules, you know what I'm saying? It's hard for me to, like, um, it, like, you know, to deal with, like, if I'm grown and then I gotta, um, listen to somebody else that's grown, but I'm, like, uh, fulfilling they, like, if I'm working for somebody else that's working for they self, I'm fulfilling their dream. I'm not fulfilling mine. You know what I'm saying? So, I got a, a problem with, like, you know, really working for people. You know what I'm saying? Like, or it's like I, I want to, like, work at my own pace. I work better alone. You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know. That's just how I feel. You know what I'm saying? This is me. I work better alone. So, um, yeah, do not be tempted to lower your standards. If it's a relationship and you dealing with somebody, it's like, um, don't be tempted to lower your standards. You know you can do better. You know you deserve better. You know you want better. You know? So, it's like, do not be tempted to lower your standards. Or it's a family member keep trying to, um, uh, you know, using you or, you know, abusing you or anybody. You could be getting abused. Don't be tempted to lower your standards because you know your worth. You know what you deserve. You know you don't deserve for somebody to be putting their hand on you. You know you don't deserve for somebody to be cheating on you, coming in the house all type of mornings. and um, You know what I'm saying? You know, you know your worth, pretty much. You know what I'm trying to say? So I'll just keep going. Just keep going, y'all. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, okay. See, they want to come out, but I, it says someone is working against you behind your back. Wow, I'm right. Okay, let's see. I'm going to put it back, though, because let's, let's keep going. Let's see. So, this message could be for you, or all of them could be for you, or she, none could be for you. Just, you know, just whatever comes out. Like I said, I don't have um, any channel messages, so I'm just, um, just pulling out energy. Oh, this is, uh, what's the message Thank you. Okay, somebody's favorite color could be purple. Man, look, I keep seeing. Oh, they can Somebody, uh, who see some something finna scare somebody. Oh my god, something finna scare somebody out. I just looked up and <laughs> looked at my cat. Oh, my jump. I don't know what the hell I jump for. Some something finna scare you, or you finna jump. I don't know what this is. But uh, August, something is significant about August, or something is happening in the month of August. Maybe you're gonna leave a situation, or a work situation, or a uh, um, family dynamic, or I don't know what this is. Some, something gonna happen in August. Too much concern with sexual matters. Somebody's concerned with like who you having sex with. Somebody's concerned about who you having sex with. I don't know who the, I don't know who that's for. Too concerned with sexual matters. That's our problem, y'all. Too concerned with se that's why all these STDs and stuff going around because y'all too concerned with sexual matters. I don't know. I keep seeing rabbits. That's enough. Why do I keep seeing rabbits, y'all? Let me hold on. Let me. I can't even do it. I ain't my phone did. Hold on, let me see. I just gotta know. How do I keep on seeing rabbits?
Oh, yeah. I gotta look it up. Y'all know I have to look up everything. The smallest things, I don't care. Okay, uh... Okay, it says something about um um important lessons about being aware and protecting ourselves and our symbols of fertility, family, and new life. Okay, so but we got protecting ourselves too much concerned with sexual matters, and then we got um um being aware of protecting ourselves. So it's like um. You know, having sex with Tom, Dick, and Harry, you need to protect yourself. Somebody's, like, too concerned, like, want to have sex all the time or concerned about who you having sex with or, I don't know, I just feel like somebody could be, like, humping like rabbits, like, constantly wanting to have sex or something. I don't know what the hell this is or concerned. Something, somebody concerned about somebody's sexual matters. Something's going on. I don't know if you were dealing with somebody, whoever this person is, you lowered your stand standards when you, and I feel like you did. You fucking did. Because now it's something, something about an STD here. Hmm. Somebody could even be getting like a letter put on their door. You know how the health department put a letter on your door saying that you need to come in for STD. I'm getting it. Did it happen to somebody or it's going to happen to somebody? Scorpio. They said protecting ourselves. Somebody didn't protect themselves. Okay, so yeah, uh, I don't know. Somebody could get like a letter on their door from the health department in August. Okay, or well, August could be just significant to somebody, okay? Or somebody like humping like rabbits, like having a lot of sex. If you a celebrity and you watching me, you you like the you like the uh, f a lot of groupies. You know what I'm saying? You like the f a lot of groupies. You need to protect yourself. Okay, spirit. What's the message for the collective? Anything that they need to know? Thank you. Okay, we have someone will try to make you do something against your will. Okay. Someone will try to make you do something against your will. So somebody finna try to make you do something that you don't want to do. And you know, you know what I'm saying? You know, like I always tell y'all, everybody got a choice. Whatever side you let, whatever side you pick, just know that the karma going to come back around whenever it do. I don't know when, when it might be a year or two, or two years from now. But just know when it, that will turn, when it's on you, when it's your turn, it's your turn. You know what I'm saying? You can be on this side of the car. You can be on this side or you can be on this side. Whatever you choose, just know it's a consequence. So with that being said, <laughs> somebody been trying to make you do something you don't want to do. And now I'm going to say it again. You got a choice and it's all up to you. And for some of y'all, somebody already tried to make you do something you didn't want to do. Put you in some shit. You really didn't want to do it, but you did it. For whatever reason, somebody could have been trying to blackmail you. Because I dropped that card on the floor earlier. It's a reason why I dropped that card. And it's right here. Somebody could have tried to blackmail you. And make you do something you didn't want to do. Hmm. But you grown. You had a choice. You know what I'm saying? So you got to just, you know, own up to that. And it's going to be a consequence behind it. And if somebody spreading STDs, is a consequence behind it. What the hell? I don't know what the hell. Somebody knew somebody had an STD and they sent this person to you or some shit like that. I don't know what this is. It's like, I want to get, somebody tried to get them some get back or some shit. And, and I don't know. Okay, what's the message? Okay, so we have increased... And I just sent it, y'all. I should have took it, but it didn't fall out. But I sent it. And y'all know when my ass touched something, and my ass touched it, and I didn't take it, and it didn't fell out. So it was meant for me to take it. Um, it says increasing material wealth and spiritual growth. Okay. Um, okay, that's a good one. 
So I don't know who that message for, but you're about to get some type of increase in material wealth also and in spiritual growth. And then it says, when I split the deck, spiritual guidance, protection from harm. So I'm getting angelic protection. You are protected from harm. Or somebody tried to um, send somebody towards you with an STD and they knew they had it and tried to, get, um, you know, make you get them. Get like you was always um, spiritually protected. You know what I'm saying? Um, you protect it. You get get you. You know what I'm saying. That it will. It can't. It will not gonna touch you. Yeah. I don't know why y'all here. And just be a man about it. Just be a man about it. You ain't got a lot of me. Look. Yeah. Somebody lied. Somebody should have been a man about it and did spread some type of oh lot whatever. So we got news on the way, okay? Some type of news is on the way. So what I'm getting here is it's right up on it's right up under August. So some type of news is on the way in the month of August, okay? Um maybe some maybe this news is about an increase in material wealth. Mm. Oh my god, look y'all and I split the deck and look what they say, wealth. Yeah. You see that? So, yeah, news on the way about some increase in wealth. There you go, right there. That's crazy. I split the deck, and there you go, right there. Yeah, this, so this is definitely what it is, double confirmation. Increase in material wealth and spiritual growth here. And then we got wealth here. I love this card. I love this card. Then we got news on the way. I'm on the way. Yeah, 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 yeah. Somebody could be on the way. Okay, let's see what else. Let me see how many minutes. Okay, 12 minutes. I'm okay. Yeah, I keep. I just say, yeah, the sun card and I say victory. Okay, so yeah. Some type of victory is here. Um, happiness. Some type of. Um, something's gonna make you happy. I feel like this is gonna. This increase in material wealth is gonna make you happy. Yeah, look. Good look. And then we got March, so something significant about March, or it could be like um your birthday or something. Yeah, great happiness on the bottom of the deck, y'all. Y'all see me shuffling. Then I say something gonna make you happy. Great happiness. Then we got March, and then we have good luck. Then we have all the we got increasing material wealth. We got wealth, and we got news on the way. So in the month of March, some type of news is on the way that's gonna make you wealthy, or something like that, or gonna make you happy. Okay. Things will not always be this way. A change is coming. So whatever you are going through, collective, things will not always be that way. Just know a change is coming. Just be patient and wait on it. You know what I'm saying? It's coming. It's coming. Some of y'all could be going through some type of family matters. Yep, I got vacation. Some of y'all could be, um, you know, getting ready to take a vacation or need to take a vacation. Or about to take a vacation or something like that. So, okay, I'm hearing sooner than you think. Okay, let's see. There's too many cards. A change for the better. So, yeah, there's definitely some type of change here. Okay, then we have um, we, um, Pardon of Ways in either Romance or Business. We have disappointed in friends or lovers, okay? Yeah, so this is like when I was talking about the, um, the, um, somebody concerned about who you having sex with or something like that. Somebody disappointed in their friend or their lover, they disappointed in this person. And, and they part ways. So, look, parting ways in either romance or business. So, somebody, so some of y'all could be parting ways because I said something about if you're not happy at that job, leave, okay? I ain't saying just leave and you ain't got another job. You can't support yourself. If you know you can't support yourself, then you know you really are not, um, you know, able to leave. You know, you know you can't go nowhere, right? So, um, you know, there's that. But I'm definitely getting, like, um, parting ways and romance. I'm getting, like, a lot of it. There might be, like, a lot of divorces going on right now. Uh, or even if you're in a relationship, you parting ways, you, you knowing your worth. You know what I'm saying? Um, you loving yourself. You working on yourself, doing your shadow work. 
or it's like leaving a job or part or like if you working with somebody you you don't want to work with them no more it's like you want to go your separate way you know what i'm saying it's like you you work better by yourself Yeah, because this ain't broken ring, so I'm definitely getting divorced. And then when I see disappointed in a friend or lover, and then parting ways in either romance, somebody's definitely getting a divorce, too. I'm seeing it, definitely. Or you just, even if it's not a divorce, you you leaving somebody. Because you disappointed in this person for whatever reason. You see this ring broke. Like, you don't even wear your ring no more. Somebody don't wear their ring no more. Yeah, so we got some news that's on the way. I'm hearing my girl, my girl. Somebody, somebody feel like you that 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 you that girl. My girl, my what's that song? I got the month of May. Why am I even? I guess you say what can make me feel this way. My girl, my girl, talking about my girl, my girl. I'm hearing it. This crazy. I heard this song in so freaking long. But anyway, somebody feel like you, you they girl. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Could be a a a a a earth sign. Earth sign, Gemini, Aquarius. Or any signs. Okay. Let's see. Somebody said, I got a love Jones for your body and your skin tone. One minute. Oh, somebody said uh, they want to get you alone or something. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, somebody is. Tripping, tripping. So we got October here. Something is significant about the month of October. This could be someone's birthday. Or something could be significant significant about fall. So we have a stubborn person, a stubborn, aggressive person. So you're dealing with a stubborn, aggressive person. Whoever this person is, you're very disappointed in them. Very, very disappointed. Someone could be like very disappointed in their child or children. Somebody's child could be sick or somebody's child could like... Like pass away or be something. I don't know. Be about to pass away or something like that or passed away. Is somebody 62 years old? Somebody named Tracy. Something gonna happen in three months. Something significant about October, November, December. October, November. Uh, I was gonna say October, November, December. <clears throat> three to five months. I don't know. I'm getting three to five months for somebody. Three to five months. I don't know what it is. Three to five months. Somebody could be pregnant. They could be three or five months. June. So we got a lot of months here. We got October. We got June. We got August. I'm here in May. How many minutes? On? Okay, yeah, I'm going to stop in a minute. Okay, so we have a distant friend is thinking of you. 
Okay, only you know who their friend is. Somebody got water bugs or somebody or something about water bugs. I don't know why I'm saying water bugs. Water bugs. Okay, somebody got uh <clears throat> I see protection from a powerful friend. So I feel like somebody's protecting you, somebody's watching over you. I'm talking about in the 3D. I don't know who I'm talking to, but I feel like Somebody's watching you. Somebody's protecting you. So somebody got angelic protection as well as, you know, protection in the 3D. Or you're protected from this two-faced friend. Somebody dealing with a two-faced friend. Or was. You was always protected. You had angelic protection against, you know... A major challenge to overcome. So there's some type of major challenge, some type of obstacle that you need to um, overcome. I feel like you haven't overcome. It's so most of y'all have, but most of y'all haven't. You haven't overcome this obstacle yet. Keep going. Keep going. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. So spiritual development, enlightenment, awareness, and understanding. I don't know if somebody's like um that your intuition like um like your spiritual development you're not uh you have major challenges to overcome in regards to your spiritual development that's for somebody okay that's not gonna be for all but that's for somebody so you know when I said something about somebody didn't pass the test it could be the initiation test in regards to your spiritual development okay I don't know who this for but it's for somebody. We, I'm seeing a lot of months, y'all. We got November. And then, didn't I say something about November, December? Okay, so we got November. We got October. We got November. I said something about December. Look, we got August. We got June. It's a lot of months here. I don't know. This could be like um, birthdays. This could be like zodiac signs, you know, in the month of August, June, October, November, okay? So this could resonate with y'all. So taking a vacation, someone's need, I think this is my second time saying this, somebody's need to take a vacation or you will be mentally or physically taking a vacation, okay? Okay, so... Okay, so it says on the bottom of the deck, a meeting with a stranger. Could be important so some of y'all may have a this strange it could be anybody it could be a lawyer it could be a judge it could be a uh doctor you know what i'm saying a lot for a lot of y'all it's gonna be a doctor because i'm seeing like stds all over the place so a lot of y'all going it's gonna be a doctor for most of y'all it's gonna be some good news coming from like uh maybe like a lawyer or it could be it you know a detective it could be you know whatever this is for you but yeah, that's what I'm getting. And then we got excitement on the bottom of the deck. Something, so some type of news on the way that's gonna excite you. I don't know what the hell this is, but you're gonna be excited. But this is gonna be a stranger. A meeting with a stranger, okay? What is this? Let's see if I can get something that's gonna tell me what this meeting is, what this meeting about. This meeting with this stranger. Could be about, look y'all. Could be about uh, my new job or career. For most of y'all, I won't resonate with all y'all, but for some of y'all, this is what it's about. Okay, let's see. What does this mean about? What does this mean about? Okay, there's two mini cards. Okay, yeah, hold on. Sometimes I like to just split the cards. 
Okay, so we have use your intuition to make beneficial changes. So whatever this meeting is about, for most of y'all, this could be something about a job or a career. Okay, use your intuition to make beneficial changes to make to to make the uh, appropriate choice. You know what I'm saying? Like, make sure you can trust this person. Make sure you look over everything. Make sure you're listening to what this, you know what I'm saying? Pay attention. Use your intuition. Okay. I keep, look, spinning the dick. Yep, new job or career. So, I mean with a stranger. Somebody want, want you to work with them. Somebody may want you to work with them or with something about a new job. Somebody can get a new job. Okay? For some of y'all, they could be the news that's on the way. For some of y'all, it's a new love. Okay? Then I see good luck on the bottom of the dick. <laughs> okay, y'all. Let me see. Ooh, 20, yeah, I got to go, y'all. I got to go. I got to go. Yeah, a period of frustration. Lessons to be learned. It's a lot of lessons. Some of y'all... Um, Oof. It's a lot of lessons some of y'all need to be um that needs to be learned. Maybe you, you feel frustrated or whatever this is. Maybe it's, it's not going as planned or it's not going how you want it to go. But there's some lessons to be learned definitely. And if you don't um learn these lessons, you will be repeating a cycle. So you might as well just go on, you know, do what you got to do. Do your little shadow work. It really it ain't hard. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. Uh. Yeah, somebody got some lessons to learn. Lessons to be learned. For whatever reason, I don't know why you frustrated or whatever this is, but you gonna have to get over them them, them little stumping blocks and uh you gonna have to you gonna have to move on. You gotta learn these lessons, you know what I'm saying? You gotta learn these lessons. So I don't know who that's for. Or maybe you getting over a period of being frustrated and you maybe you learning you're learning these lessons. I don't know. A lot of y'all are also needing to forgive. Um, you know, you can't get into heaven with a heavy heart. I tell y'all that all the time. Um, you know what I'm saying? You ain't got to forget. A lot of y'all have a problem forgiving. I understand it. You know, it is what it is. You know, because some of y'all been through so much. But, you know, this this y'all. I can't I can't talk for y'all. I'm not judging nobody. It's on you. What you want to do. I choose to just forgive and, and move on. You know what I'm saying? Just don't, I just ain't going back to their place. You know what I'm saying? I can't go back there. I can't go back to feeling that way. I can't go back. To, I just can't go back. Hell no. I can't even imagine. <laughs> I can't even imagine going back to something in my past. You know what I'm saying? I can't imagine. <laughs> I'm talking about it goes for anybody. Because if you cross me, then you want me to be in my life regardless. You know what You know what I'm saying? And it's just how I feel. An emotional... Secure love and family is important to you, okay? Yeah, so, yeah, I feel the same way. Somebody pregnant. So, I feel like you're all about being secure. You're all about loving your family. That's very important to you, whoever you are. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, you're all about taking care of your family wherever you go. Your family most definitely going. Somebody got three kids. Okay, y'all. I think I'm going to end. So, we got you are highly thought of. So, collective, you are highly thought of. That means people love you. You know what I'm saying? Despite what somebody told them, people love you. Yeah. Forces working against you. I'm getting like people were working against you. Um, what's this? Slander? Slander your name or something like that? Like somebody did that. Pe working against you to make other people not like you. But you, you had it thought of. This shit didn't work. Look at that. Money pass. Money pass. Money, money bag. Money bag. Money bag. Somebody got a money bag. News on the way about a pay for money. It wait for you to find it. Yeah, then we had good luck on the bottom of the deck. So, you guys, I'm going to end this reading. It's just, uh, um, you know, some intuitive messages since I didn't, you know, channel any messages. 
So I hope it helped y'all. I hope it resonated. You know, we do got some good messages in here. So I hope they resonated with you guys. And until next time, see you guys later. Bye.